registered there. So that's the opening of uh, the Chacon. Uh, I want to try it again and be more regular in the sound, not too loud at the beginning. Opening four bars, maybe the next four bars can build a little. Uh, bring it back down for bum, ba bum, ba da dum. I want to have a really clean articulation there. I have to check which voice to use for the chords and harmonies if I have to sustain the bottom note um, or if it's not necessary. Okay, Lips and Seminoff's buy versions are, I think quite similar here. I, I prefer to stay away from the Stradella bass um, both Lips and Seminoff used the Stradella in this piece. Uh, I don't think I will, personally. Um, but yeah, we'll give it a go and I'll try to be a bit, a bit more clearer with the other voice scenes. I'm not sure if I should keep the... Oh, yeah, I should. Because <laughs> I was trying to get a clearer... It wasn't working too well, but if I hold the chords as they're written... It will sound like they're clearer than they're... It'll protect them and make them sound a little bit clearer. So let's give that another go. I take off. The, I should take off the, immediately from there. Okay, so before I just keep on playing the same thing again. Uh, what I should be working on here is following both parts, the higher voice and the theme. This, uh, although it's not that one there. Uh, uh. It's a master switch here. Seminoff uses bassoon. So master would be. And bassoon is. Um, something in between, maybe? Not that one. So 
be following mostly the bass. I don't know how I want to play this. This is a discovery. Um... Definitely, definitely not legato. A kind of legato, but a bit detached. Screensaver. <laughs> register is nicer. Uh, so the danger there is now we're having the pedal tones, it's going to want to feel really quite heavy. So I want to drop the volume a lot there. Octave higher because it's not so good. Yeah, I think the bass octaves don't have to be pedal. sure I have to fiddle around with the registers so that's the first nearly first two pages um, 
touching upon variation four, which will leave three more, uh, or two more, until the part I was working on today, the... So that's quite cool. Um, what else did uh, work today? Worked today with this, uh, the bass, it sounds really a lot better. seems <laughs> uh, seems lucky that I got it so I decided to stop because I was gonna <laughs> muck it up really quickly afterwards I haven't uh, recorded that part yet, but that's what I've started working on. Uh, but overall, kind of happy with the progress. I've uh, been working on, I think, six variations in total. Uh, there's a lot more to happen and a lot harder ones. But that's where I started and uh, continue working tomorrow. Have a good one. <laughs>